I don't think I did anything wrong. You know, I was felt like I was in a position to be able to say something when I saw something that wasn't right. Uh, and I think morally it was the right thing to do. And I think there are people who know that there's a lot of things that aren't right in the world at the moment, but will not say anything because they're frightened that they'll lose their job. You know, and the fact that that is even a thing should tell you that something isn't right in this world. You are frightened to give an opinion on something because you're going to get cancelled. The fact that we have that alone should be enough for people to go, I don't want to live in this world. I don't want to live in a world that, that where you are f- so scared to say something that you might get cancelled and get sacked from your job. It's not right. And that is a world that I thought was in a country like China. And I never thought that I would feel like that in this country. Conspiracy theorist, misogynist, racist. You just use all these terms and go, right, I've used that word now. I don't have to debate with them anymore because I've taken the moral high ground. I've called him a name and uh, now everyone's going to think he's that. And it's just a really childish way of actually shutting down debate. And it's something that everybody should be concerned about. Because without free speech, there's a real opportunity for a tyrannical government to take over. And I think we are at the beginnings of that. It needs to be nipped in the bud. And that's why that's why I decided to speak out.